Hey guys, Cody here. Welcome back to this uh, playthrough of Dark Souls. Now let's continue our journey onto the High Wall of Lotharic. Look at that scenery. Holy crap. God, this I love this game. The, the, the visuals are just so good. So here we have our first bonfire. We're gonna run all over here. And we're just gonna avoid these enemies. I'm gonna pick this up. I think this is another soul, yeah. I'm gonna run by these guys. Cause honestly, there's no point in really fighting these guys. Mimics, they don't really give too many souls. And it's just not worth our time. So what I just picked up there is a gold pine resin. And um, that is a item that uh, buffs your weapon with lightning damage, and if you're gonna chase me, I'll kill you. Alright, alright. Come on. Alright, I, I get it, I get it, I get it. Alright, there we go. So, it puts, um, lightning on your, on your, uh, right hand weapon, and the thing is, because I put the fire gem on the spear, I actually cannot use it. So, weapons, like, that have certain gems cannot be buffed, uh, certain... Weapons, which we'll get into at a later time, uh, cannot be buffed at all by items. And we're just gonna run over here before this dragon kills us, alright? Gonna get in here, gonna get in here. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, there we go. So I just killed everything else. Come on, really? Really? Can he not get in here? I guess he can't. So I'm gonna take this advantage. Alright, now these, this guy can be about getting. That's cool that the one guy just blocked everything for us. So, you can actually kill this dragon. Oh, wow, that's cool. He drops a Titanite shard. You can kill this dragon if you uh, have a bow and a lot of arrows. So, about 70 to 80 arrows it'll take to kill him. And uh, what you get out of it is a large Titanite, and there's some items over there which. Um, the one all the way over there is a claimer, which is a very good strength weapon. And um, I'm going to go over something I should have went over in the last video. And that is the scaling with weapons. And if you just dump a lot of points, say, into strength, when the weapon has an A scaling in it, it's actually, okay, that is very loud. It's not great to go at or, through, excuse me, it's not great to go over 40, 50 points depending on the weapon. Once you reach 50, you probably should stop putting points in it. And uh, each uh, level has a hard cap at 99, really. But uh, there's some benefits to just stopping at 40. And for example, endurance, you should stop putting points in endurance at 30. Because you actually don't get any more stamina with endurance. And with that explained, let's continue on. Oh, I did not touch the stairs. So as you can see, we have a chest over here. And it's not an ordinary chest. If you look at this right chain, you see it's kind of just sticking out. That will explain something in one second. I need to be very careful. If the chain's loop, feel free to open it. But if it's not loop, that is not okay. So what this is, is a mimic. It's a false chest. I'm actually going to two hand for this. And you kind of just want to roll around him and not get hit. Because this guy will kill you. Whoa! Yeah, he has a very unique moveset. And he kind of has more health than most. Whoa, I don't like how close I am. I don't like it. All right, so that's a grab. You don't want to get hit by that. If you get hit by that, you're dead. Without a doubt. All right. A couple more hits. I'm just playing this very safe because you can die very quickly. All right, and that should be it. There we go. And what he drops is a deep battle axe and a lot of souls. So uh, what deep is, is it's basically just dark damage on a weapon. All right, that is getting really annoying, that dragon. And it's actually, um, there's beneficials to having that weapon early on. It's actually very powerful. All right. 
Come on, let's go. These guys are very fast. These are knights, of course. And they kind of hurt. Oh, crap. I'm actually going to run by these guys. Just because it's not safe right now to take on both of them. And up here we have another bonfire. Oh, this is not good. Okay, the other knight didn't follow. Alright, so that actually worked out for us. So I'm gonna light this bonfire. Gonna rest at it. And then we'll head back downstairs in one second. But first we're gonna come over here and we're gonna pick up this Titanite shard right here. Alrighty. So let's head back downstairs and let's try not to aggro that guy. And let's try and walk on this pillar or this beam. We just got some fire bombs. That'll be useful. Alright. Is there anyone else I gotta look out for? No? Okay, I'm gonna climb down these steps. Oh, I lied! Wow, I actually took no damage, but I bled. Come on, I wanna drop attack. Oh, or I'll do this. Whoa! That did not hit him. He had him in stability frames. There we go. Actually, let me see if I can use the deep battle axe. I uh, yeah, this would be better. So as I was talking about uh, weapon arts, uh, axes actually have a very cool weapon art, and that just increased my damage by 20%. Very good. This axe is very useful. Very, very useful. Oh, okay, there you are. And it's just a very good weapon. Uh, cannot go through there yet. Let's go over here. And it's a lot faster than the spear. It doesn't have as much range, but I am fully okay with it from the speed. You kind of want weapons that attack more. Mailbreaker, that, that's a pretty alright um, early game weapon, I'll say. It's not the greatest when it comes to... Uh, just damaging but it's very good for early game but if you can get the s dock it's way better and it's locked but there's some guy behind that so we're gonna we're gonna try and see how we can get in there so i guess the only option we have is to go back upstairs and actually uh we got some throwing knives i think this will be useful yeah eight throwing knives uh i think i'm gonna equip the fire spear for this next part coming up so if you had the fire gem, this next uh, guy we're going to fight, it's not a boss, but it's just a very hard enemy. There's no sweat. If you don't, but you have some black fire bombs, or those fire bombs you just picked up, that's good. Uh, other than that, you probably should not fight this guy coming up, because he is no joke. Ow. There should be a guy climbing. Oh, no, not yet. All right. So be very careful approaching, and the first guy that's going to stand up, make sure you just step away. An alternative is, when he starts doing this, kill him before he does that. So. So he's very weak to fire. But as you can see, he hits like a truck. So as long as you can not get, oh my god, he's so fast. Ah, oh, darn, I thought I could maybe get him uh, chained in with that. I didn't know. Uh, I've actually never used, um, I've never used the uh, fire gem ever, so I didn't know how that would work in that situation. I mainly either, if you have a bow and arrow, like I used, I just climbed up here right after he transformed and I just shot him with an arrow a lot. Alright. Here we go. He's dead. And so 
so what I'm gonna do for this then is fire bombs. Cause you really don't need fire bombs too much. Come away till he kills everything. Oh, wrong, wrong item. time and only time you kill him really he will drop a titanite shard and an ember very useful oh and there's some fire bombs right next to him that's useful and over here we have a crystal lizard and these guys are really fast and really annoying to chase but if you kill them they drop some pretty useful items and right here is the raw gem the raw gem is very very good if you are uh, for early game items that were weapons I'm sorry that won't carry you through the whole game and uh, I'm actually going to pick up an item in one second that is phenomenal with, with a raw gem. It's just, with a raw gem at just no upgrading, it's actually better than um, most upgraded weapons that are like plus six. It, it's kind of ridiculous. So I'm going to go heal up since we only have two Estuses. And as you saw, I actually gained an Estus from killing an enemy. Each enemy has a small chance of giving an Estus charge. Very strange. Come on. And now that I don't need to kill the pus of a man anymore, I'm going to equip the deep battle axe for uh, attack speed. Because I prefer attack speed more than anything. Alright, just going to repeat the process. Kill these guys. Yeah, see, I'm hitting for 104 versus 74, I think. And the deep battle axe would actually not work against the Puss of a Man just because uh, he's actually highly resistant to dark, because that's actually what we kind of transformed in. So now we're going to climb down this ladder or just, you know, shortcut it. We're gonna kill these guys because it'll make our job easier. Ow. Hit this guy off. Nope. Grab this. We got some more fire bombs. They just love to give us fire bombs. We're gonna wait for this guy to come up because he will chase us. Come on. And it's a shame. He's gonna climb all the way up here just for this to happen. Hi, bye. <laughs> Spartan for this is Sparta for him. Jesus, it sucks. All right, gonna quickly go in here. Oh wow, I didn't expect to kill him. Grab another Titanite shard. It's very useful. And actually, I'm probably gonna use this fire bomb. So I, when you yell, it kind of gets the attention. Ooh. Whoa. I'm trying to backstab him. So if you, oh, okay. Whoa. So when you also um, weapon art with battle axes, you also get a different uh, heavy attack if it's charged. And as you saw, I just slammed him into the ground and a lot of uh, axes have that ability. So we're gonna come in here. Oh, missed. Broadsword, that is a very good weapon to give a raw um, gem to, but we're actually coming to an item very soon that is Phenomenal with the raw gem. Um, let's see. How do I want to do this? I, I know how I want to do this, I think. We'll go over here. This room is very, very... Oh, God, that scared me, actually. 
Uh, dangerous. Super dangerous. Oh, I didn't even know this chest existed. Yeah, see how that the chains loop? That's how you know it's not a mimic. Silver Eagle kite shield. Huh. How it doesn't hold compared to ours. So it's a little more heavier, and it actually has worse stats. It only has better physical defense. Another raw gem. Wow, that's actually a uh, rare... Um, a small chance to get that. Uh, no, I am not Kobe Bryant. There we go. That dog is the main issue with this room. Alright, so now I feel safe to go down here. And slowly, with those throwing knives, I'm going to kite these guys back. Oh! Oh, crap. Yeah, see just how fast it is and how much damage I did. Like, ah, oh, it's just so good. So there's one more dog, I think, over here. Yeah, there it is. I want to I wanna play this safe. So I'm going to grab this guy's attention. So if you actually get behind someone, you can actually do a, a backstab, which is, does a large amount of critical damage as well. We're going to grab another Titanite shard over here, and now we only have two more things to take care of in this room. Got another Estus shard. That's very good. And we're going to take out this last dog. This dog, these dogs can be kind of annoying just as how fast they are. And over here we got the cell key. So basically we're 99% done with this room. Could this be a ring? Um, some people post trolley stuff with their soap stones, so also be careful about that. There's no ring back there on this current playthrough, but I actually think there is a ring on future playthroughs. So we're going to go up here, back where we came from. We're going to actually jump through here. And we're going to pick up some items we couldn't grab because just uh, wanted to clear the room. And when we drop down here, we can no longer get back up. So it's safer to take care of everything like we just did there. And in here, we have a store straight sword. This with a raw gem is phenomenal. That It's just a great, 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 great weapon. It'll... It, it's a very good starting weapon. The only thing is you just need 13 uh, or 12 faith to use it. So with that, I think we're going to just take the uh, Homer bone back to where we came from. And I think I'm going to stop the episode here, guys. We, we made a lot of progress. And that cell key, um, we're going to see where that goes to in the next episode. All right, guys? So thanks. If you like the video, feel free to subscribe and like it. All right? See you guys next time.